you have saggy breasts, big breasts, small breasts, whatever the case may be. Because you are still If this is you, I need you to listen up. If your breasts have started to sag, maybe because you have a few kids and you've been breastfeeding, maybe because of old age, or maybe your breasts have started to sag because you was overweight and now you've lost a bit of weight and it hasn't had the best effects on your breasts. Well, listen, if this is you, I've got something to tell you. I said this in part one and I'm gonna say this in part two. Yes, you might see on social media, some some girls with perky breasts, some girls might even get plastic surgery. And if you don't want something like this, if you want to work on your breasts naturally, we're going to do this together. Because you are still sexy regardless if you have saggy breasts, big breasts, small breasts, whatever the case may be. So I just wanted to get that off my chest real quick. <laughs> Ladies, you answer it, so here it is. This is part two to how you can tone your breasts. We're gonna incorporate some dumbbells, some resistance. So follow along with me, get yourself on the mat, and let's do this, ladies. Let's go. Ladies, one more thing that I genuinely feel like is gonna help you. I have a private Facebook group with thousands of women all working together, giving each other motivation and accountability. And I wanna give that to you for completely free. Doors will be closing. So I want you to click the link down below, introduce yourself into the group, and let's build this community. Let's make it stronger and let's do this together. Click the link below and let's do this workout. Let's go. Okay, ladies, we're gonna do four different exercises just to warm up. So your hands are on your shoulders. You're gonna do a small rotation while keeping your core engaged. We wanna warm up our shoulders because as we are doing these exercises, especially with weights, you might feel a bit of tension in your shoulders, which is normal, yeah? We're gonna do a few more. Now we're gonna rotate the opposite way. Again, keeping your back straight. You don't wanna be down here when you're doing it. Back straight, keep your core engaged, and rotate. Keep going, bit more. Well done, shake it off. After each exercise, with weights or with just your own body weight, make sure you shake it off, you keep rotating your shoulders, you wanna feel nice and warm, yeah? All we're gonna be doing, is our elbows are gonna be 90 degrees, so it's gonna be in line with our shoulders. We're going to keep our core engaged. We're gonna bring it in together, and when you bring it in, squeeze your chest. So open up, squeeze, open up, squeeze. I can't stress enough, your posture, your back should be straight. You shouldn't be here, because you won't feel any tension in your chest, yeah? In your pectoral muscles, you wanna feel it right in the middle. Squeeze. Good work, ladies. You've got 10 more seconds left. Again, we're just warming up. Three, two. And relax. Remember, shake it off. Even your hands, elbows. You're gonna start feeling it right in your chest real soon. All right, we're gonna be moving into our next exercise. We're gonna make small circles. So your arms are straight. Make sure your chest is high. Don't wanna be down here. Every time you bring it in, you squeeze your chest together. When you bring it up, squeeze your upper chest. In, lower chest. So we're right here. When you're doing this, you might lean back a bit. Try your best not to lean back because it takes tension out of your chest. You can have a small lean back, but try and be upright. If you can see my chest is pushing out, that's exactly what I want you ladies to be doing. If you have to slow it down just a bit, squeeze that chest. Three, two, one. Well done. That's it, shake it off. That was really good. Well done ladies. All right, we've got one more just to warm up and we're gonna be working our upper back. We're doing that because when it comes to your posture, that will play a big part in just your development of your breasts because you might be slanted all the time. Let's get that posture up. So our arms are straight, bring it in, squeeze your back and then repeat. Arms straight, squeeze, squeeze. Imagine there's a bar 
right above you and you're pulling it right down, squeezing your back and then repeat. 10 more seconds, let's go. Try and get as many as you can. Keep that back straight, core tight, chest up. Three. One more. One. And relax. Shake it off. Now I want you to get a pair of dumbbells or you can use resistance bands when doing these exercises. So you can have at least 20 to 30 second rest and then we're getting into it. So get your dumbbells up and let's go. Okay ladies, right now we're moving into resistance. So get your dumbbells up. We're gonna alternate sides. So first things first, we're gonna go across the body, squeezing your chest back down and then across the body. Let's go. Every time you go across the body, I want you to squeeze your pectoral muscles and control back down. Try your best not to use momentum and swing your arms. Nice and controlled and squeeze. Keep your head up, keep your back straight, and use that mind-muscle connection. Reach right across your body. Great work. Three, two, one. Well done. Remember with that little rest, shake it off. Rotate those shoulders. Now we're gonna be doing the same thing, but we're gonna go at the same time, both arms going in the middle. Try your best not to lean back as the resistance might push you back, yeah? So back straight, squeeze your chest and down. Squeeze and down. Great work, ladies. Remember what we're working, try and have a two second pause at the top, really contracting that chest. Remember, try your best not to swing. You don't want no momentum when you're doing this. Stop at the bottom, pause at the top, bam. Ooh, I can definitely feel it in my chest. Ooh, let's get a few more. Three, two, one. Great work, great work. Oh, shake it off, remember, rotate those shoulders. Well done, ladies. Now we're gonna put one dumbbell down. Holding onto the other one, all we're going to do is hold it right in the middle. We're gonna keep the dumbbell close to our chest. We're gonna push out and squeeze your chest together. Squeeze back in the middle. Push out and squeeze, keep your back straight, core tight, back in the middle, let's go. Really squeeze that chest together, ladies. Well done. Nearly done. 10 more seconds. Oh. Three, two, one more. One. Great work. Now we are going down onto the mat. So let's go. Oh, okay, ladies, we are now onto the floor. So I want you to get your dumbbells. We're going into a dumbbell chest press. So if you go down, you can have a small arch in your lower back, bringing your chest up. Elbows are 45 degrees. You push up, squeeze your chest. Control back down. Up, squeeze, control down. Let's go. Do as many reps as you can. Remember, mind muscle connection. Squeeze that chest at the top. Control down. Let's go. Great work, ladies. You've got 10 more seconds left. I need some more from you. Squeeze. And relax. Now we are spinning round, we're going into press ups. But with the press ups, your knees are going to be on the mat. You're gonna go a little bit wider than shoulder width. With the knees on the mat, you're gonna go as low as you can. Bring your chest all the way down, stretch that chest and contract at the top. So control down, stretch that chest. 
contract at the top. Focus on your breathing, so deep breath in, keeping everything engaged and tight. And breathe out. Exhale when you're coming up. Let's go, 10 more seconds. Oh, feel that stretch in your chest at the bottom. Squeeze coming up. Three, Squeeze coming two, up. Get one more for me. Oh, great work, ladies. Great work. You've got one more exercise for me. I just need one more from you. Yeah, so you're gonna hold onto one dumbbell, put the other one to the side. <clears throat> you're gonna have your elbows tucked in. You're gonna push up and squeeze your chest at the top. So push up, squeeze your chest. Two second pulls at the top and down. Squeeze, one, two, down. One, two, as soon as your elbows touch the mat, you are straight back up. There's no rest at the bottom. Two second pulls at the top. But squeeze your chest together. I can't stress this enough or you will not feel it. Come on, ladies, so our last one. Let's rep it out, let's go. 10 more seconds, rep it out for me. Three, two. Mm. Beautiful, beautiful work. I am so proud of you. Honestly, well done to every single one of you getting through this workout. Oh, my chest is burning. <laughs> Well done to every single one of you. Listen, give yourself a round of applause because I am proud of you for getting through this workout. Now, I don't want you to go anywhere. You can try this workout right here. And like I said in the intro, join the private Facebook group with thousands of other women before I close the doors, yeah? I'm gonna build this community and I wanna give you extra support. So join, I'm waiting for you.